And then what I've been doing, now this, men, this is the secret sauce to get a nice, dark, thick beard and have the women go crazy. Hey, what up, man? It's your boy, k Power Performance. In today's video, I want to show you guys how to grow your beard. Now, if you can see, I have this patch here and there, and it don't look good. So I got to use that little filler shit and spray it in because it don't look good. Like, why is it not grow the fuck in the way it's supposed to? And I got it on selfie, so that's why I'm looking at it kind of weird. But anyway, I'm going to show you guys what I purchased. And I want to show you if this shit fucking works. Minoxid. The simple way to grow your little baby bitch beard. No, seriously, it is about 12 o'clock. Well, about to be 12 o'clock on a Monday. So this is what my beard looks like after one week. Maybe uh, I got a haircut last friday so it was shaved down but this is pretty much what my beard looks like yeah it can grow more but it ain't nice i'm having issues growing under here now i've let it grow out before but it still was super patchy and literally i'd have to spray shit on it and oh, come on the girls want the big beard we got we got the big beard guys so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show you guys week one week two week three week four week five week six and after three months we'll see if this works so let me give you guys one last look. And yeah, let's see what it does. What's up, gang? So this is that following Monday. I just applied some. So when I was first doing this, I was using like way too much of this stuff. Like there's only supposed to be like one milliliter or something or whatever. And I was doing that a couple times on my face. So a lot of people, they drip it, like, you know, and then they like, just keep doing that. It ends up making a mess. Just go where you want with your hairline and just wipe it in. I feel like it's a lot better and I'm not using as much. But yep, this is week one of Minoxin. And so far, I don't see shit. Face did get a little irritated, sorry, I just got the shower, so I know I'm red and ugly as shit right now. And it's early in the morning. But, yeah. It's definitely making it rougher. The, the the hairs are more brittle. I could feel that. So it's definitely doing something. Skin definitely dry. Make sure you get some a uh, good moisturizer. Where the hell is mine at? I don't know where my moisturizer's at. But make sure you get a good moisturizer that you can rub all on your beard before you do it. I've been doing it every night before I go to bed and every day when I wake up. And I don't wipe it off. I leave it on there and just let it completely dry on there. Some people probably don't, but I have been. And I think that's going to get you better results faster. So I'll let you guys know next monday and that'll be week two all right so Shit. this is week two just got out the shower get ready for work and this is what we're looking like not too bad still patchy i got my new tool if i can get this thing the hell out Ugh. i got my new tool that a lot of people recommend it yeah and pretty much all you do is just roll your beard with it. This is a 1.0. It's a little big, as you can see. But I didn't want to do this and make a video and not try to get the best gains that I could possibly get. And, yes, I am on the selfie one. So, it looks retarded. But, as you can see, I'm still very patchy right there. Look like shit because I had a long Super Bowl weekend. Let's go Rams. But, yep, this is week two. So we'll just keep going and I'll keep you guys updated to about week eight to maybe week 10. So yeah. Good guys, this is week three. And I do not know if it looks any different. I don't really think it does, but I have been using this bad boy. And all you do is just roll it on your face. And when you already have hair there, it doesn't I don't think work as good. But for like that patch, it works. And what I do is I use this out the shower, all on the face, open the pores, and then I use my Minoxyl, use that, and that seems to help. And I am growing the beard out. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do this real quick after I put some moisturizer on, which you guys aren't going to see, but you will see this. Just give you an idea how this stuff works. Also say so you can use it on your face and stuff, it's just a build collagen i don't know if that's fucking true but this is a 1.0 i did go a little extreme i don't know if you guys can see that with this crappy iphone but 
I want some fucking progress. And ain't nobody sitting here for fucking three years trying to grow up a beer. But one thing I will say is that if you look right here, this used to be like really like I remember at one point it'd be like a couple hairs. Now look at it. Yeah, that's 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 connected completely now. So that makes me pretty happy, but I still have this fucking patch. But the hair is growing. And yeah, so this is week three. And let me put the moisturizer on and I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. All right, now that we're all moisturized, what you're gonna do is you're gonna get this bad boy. It's gonna say a one milliliter. Pick it in there, a little bit more. Now, when I was first doing this, I ran through a bottle in about one week, two weeks. I was doing way too fucking much. So all you do, I'm gonna try to do this a whole this. I am on selfie mode, so sorry. But what I do is I just go like this. I go right on the hairline because oh, what it's going to do is it's just going to drip down anyway. So that's just what I do. I just do it like that. And as you can see, it's kind of already just dripping down a little bit for here. You don't need a lot. And then what I do is I go grab a little thing and I just do this. And kind of just rub it in. Yep. Try to give you guys the real man tutorial. Because we need this beard. I don't know about you guys, but if you're at home and you're watching this video, then you feel my pain. Maybe you feel it more than me. Maybe you feel it less. But K-pop performance is here to help. So that's all I do. Wrap it in. Boo, 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 boo. And she's done. She's wet just like she likes it. Mm -hmm. So I will update you guys on my next week, Monday. And that'll be week four. And I think I want to make this video... Maybe 12 weeks, 12 to 16 weeks. I really want to get some progress. Now, mind you, I'm growing this out, so it would have grown out regardless, guys. I do have some type of beard, but it's not the greatest. But I do feel like it's... Uh, this side don't look that bad. It's light, but it's kind of there. This side is still patchy, patch, patch. But at the end of the day, it's a journey, it's a process. So that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to make sure that I'm transparent with you guys so you guys get to fucking enjoy and see this. So if you want to buy this kit, which I recommend, you can see if it works. It's six months supply and it was only about 30 some dollars. But there is a catch. This is alcohol based. So my fucking skin dries out so much i'm out in the cold i'm in the diesel industry sometimes i gotta go out and get a truck blah 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 and it's just it's just super it almost looks like dandruff it's so dry so make sure you have a lot of moisturizer they do make a lotion style but it's like 71 dollars, and i think it's like a month so it could be different i'm not sure but i figured i paid for this shit i'm gonna get my fucking money's worth but as long as you put moisturizer on it i think you'll be okay and yeah, now I'm rambling. We'll go to week four. Let's go. Yo, we at work, guys, and this is Wednesday. It's hump day right now, and I was looking at my beard, and right here, like, I'm going to try to zoom it in. I don't know if y'all see that, but it's finally starting to get, like, 
the the hairs are coming in, bro. Like they're they're fully coming in. Like with the right light on, you can completely see them. Like holy shit, my beard is getting long, and my sideburns have grown so fast, bro. That I'll, I need to get my beard like done again. Like it's growing fast, but yo, like this used to be so bald, and now it's just like there's hair there, like legit fucking hair growing from there. Finally, like. So, this shit's working. I can't wait to show what three, what, what are we going to do? 13 weeks? Let's get it. 13 weeks. Let's see what it looks like. Alright, what's up kings? I hope y'all feeling great. Y'all come to the end of the video and here is the result. Came in pretty good and right in time because it was my birthday. Your boy just turned the big dirty 30. Woo! Comment down below. Wish me a happy birthday if you watch this video. If not, whatever. I'm old now. I guess I can't cry about it. But I want to go over the tips and just so you guys know, one last time that this beard and better beard than even this is achievable by using this stuff. So I want you to go and I want you to buy the Kirkwood, is it Kirkland Minoxyl. This is the drops. They do have a lotion one that won't dry your skin out. Me personally, I just put more moisturizer. It's cost me 30 bucks for six months supply. I haven't even been using this stuff in almost a week now because <laughs> it came in. Now I want you guys to get a 1.0, a little bit. 1.0 roller and 1.0 means how long these are this helped a lot because this allowed me to poke the hole in the skin and then when i put the oil in it allowed the hair to grow a lot faster and then what i've been doing now this men this is the secret sauce to get a nice dark thick beard and have the women go crazy you ready? Now, I didn't see nobody yet do this on YouTube. I'm the first one that show anybody this over one of these beard videos. At least I think so from the research that I've seen. Yeah. Get you one of these. Before you get your hair cut, pimp, I want you to dye your beard. This is a dark brown. It's real easy. You just mix one, it's an activator and another one. You just mix them, squeeze them out. It's like toothpaste. As long as they're equal, you'll be okay. Mix it up, put it on there for five, 10 minutes. The longer it's on there, the longer it's gonna stain. I let it sit on there for like 10 minutes now because what I do is I, I put it on, I wash off, and obviously I'll use my roller. Uh, I'll probably moisturize. I usually moisturize before I put the minoxyl on and the roller just because you need to let your skin get a little bit of lubrication because otherwise it dries out a lot. But do that, just make sure you use that, wash your face, moisturize, let everything dry, use your roller, come back with your minoxyl, go to bed, wake up, go get a haircut. And then that's how it goes like that. And I don't know if you guys can see it, but this was so patchy my whole life and it just feels good. Those hairs are growing, they're black. So I know they're gonna be here anytime now and yeah, so we went from looking like a crusty regular guy to looking like don't bring your girl around me. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe. I want to start doing more stuff like this for my kings. We always still do car stuff, but I've been taking a little break on life. I just got out of a seven-year relationship. I live on my own. I work 40 hours a week, so everybody wants to be on here, jump into content. But honestly, I only want to make content that helps my kings feel the best. So enjoy the video. Please give it a like. Please comment what you think. If you have any tips or something I missed out, please go down there and comment for the next guy. Till then, I'll see y'all later. Peace!